Now we folks, this time we'll try and show you the uh, distant way to unhook a lander and its deep hooks like this. Uh, there's a video I clicked on the favourites that shows this technique but it's not that clear unfortunately. So we'll try and show you here a little bit better. Right, first of all, you want to Try and get the bait out of the fish's mouth. So, just slide the ragworm up. Now all we need is a little bit of wire like this. A bit of grip wire will do. And just make that kind of shape in it. And then we feed it through the gill cover carefully so you don't actually damage any of the gill rakers and then out through the mouth like so see that a bit better and then wrap the line round a few times and then all you need to do now is just feed that back through like so See the lines there. Now, another look. See there, the hook is just on the inside the kill cover. Being a little bit there we go. You can see where the hook is. And then all I have to do is just push up on the eye of the hook. There we go. And the flounder's unhooked. Then it can go swim again, no damage to it at all. I should say that this method only really works very well um, if you're using long shank hooks. So most people use long shank hooks when flounder fishing and you know, sizes like a two they're up over. Small hooks uh, aren't usually long enough. managed to pop them out but there we go we've got both so all I did there slide the wire through cut the line try and do both at the same time there we go both unhooked easy